Now I gotta watch my part length a little better. Eee, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Skip the hint art. Um, uh, what was this over here that I missed before? I don't know, but we're going there. We're gonna see. I mean, I didn't clear out everything, so things have got to... Wait, maybe it's up here. This is Lisa. Maybe, maybe it's somewhere high, basically. Wait, actually. Uh, no, I should be zeroing in using the map a little bit better here. Uh, actually, maybe it really is up on top of there. In which case, I probably should go and get Glide on. Because, yeah, I don't remember it being on, like, the ground floor over there. Because I think I actually got a hint for this before on my other plays. Uh, mm, wait, where was the... I'm lost, I'm lost! <laughs> Okay, oh, I can actually just use... Okay, yeah, it is up there. But yeah, I could just use the power line as well and get across there and then exit the power line, but uh, I don't need it. That'll do on top of the stone archway. What is this X? What is this X? I think that X that's at the pyramid is inside. It's another one of those note things in the 8-bit areas, I think. Anyway. Uh, it's down uh, this way, I guess? It's not down... Whoa, whoa, what the? Why did I zoom out there? I wasn't touching anything. Okay. <laughs> Whatever! It's fine now. <laughs> How about in here? Is this what I'm looking for? Maybe it is. Probably not, though. Nah, it's not. Okay, it's, I'm close to the area, though. This I obviously got before. This is the moon that'll poop out on the other side. So that's not the one. Unless it's something under here. This is all like some nook and cranny type area down over there. I was correct. <laughs> Alcove in the ruins. Can I? Can I really warp? Oh, I can warp here. I never. I, th I thought it wouldn't have worked if I would have warped there. Um, okay, back up there then. But it, that didn't work at all. <laughs> so I was right. It doesn't work when you're in quicksand. Okay. It, it, like, why did the flags show if I couldn't use them to warp then? I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, pyramid. I want to go to actually. I think. Ah. Uh, well, I mean, yes, I want to go in the lower part of the pyramid, but I just want to be sure it's not, like, up here or anything like that. Nah, I already took care of J- Oh! Maybe it's Peach that the, it's directing me to. That certainly seems plausible, but yeah. <laughs> I was going to do her near last, but I think this huge stone thing could float. The world is full of wonders. How does it float? Why is it inverted? So mysterious! I even found a moon power moon in the sand. Take good care of it. Well, I guess that's the X. <laughs> but yeah, I thought it had more to do with the... Oh, maybe I'm thinking about the other one that I already got on the Jaxi tail. I was just thinking about the place with the beautiful flower fields. I'd like to see them again. So basically, she's going over to the gardeners. And I've got to go probably, I think, down that hole. <laughs> Uh, I actually, um, I don't think they're gonna both be at that other area. Like, I, I think that's just a, a quick place over to the uh, boss arena, but I don't remember there being something specifically there. So I'm gonna start from over here instead and take a look, see around. Oh. How did I manage to do that? Skip! Oh! No skip! Skip again! Alright, it worked that time. No! Oh! Wow, I am playing horrifically here. No, I guess there wasn't something there. Oh, there- Oh, I see! That's right, because the ring is put back over here. If I may ask, what price are you asking for that ring? <laughs> Not for sale. Oh, what, 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 what you got? 
I got I found the papa ring by ring, but uh, it's too big to carry. Well, no one's getting this ring then. What do you have to say? I want a ring like this someday. It would not even fit on your finger, or fit on anyone's finger. I swear. <laughs> but yeah, this over here. See, it's glowing. Boink. Yeah, that's one of the two. But I don't remember the other one then. If it's not. I thought, like, maybe there's a pipe together, yeah, they're both together, but if they're not together, I'm not sure. <laughs> maybe it's over at the boss arena? I don't know. Actually, I think I remember what it, <clears throat> what it was. What you're supposed to do is go over here and keep killing the kombus. Just keep killing them. Yeah, all these guys that are gonna pop out, keep them dead and keep them constantly dead <laughs> and eventually one of a different color will appear will appear somewhere else basically if I recall correctly so let's just keep wiping them out there's a lot of them but <laughs> they're not that dangerous they just kind of are, are, are there <laughs> maybe I should take a look see around here see if there's another one elsewhere that'll pop up hmm. No, not yet. Nope, nope, uh, uh Oh, those other ones, whoops. Those other ones disappeared. I ran too far away from them. Alright, I'll just keep comboing the combos and see what comes out of it. Come on, at least I think this is what I'm supposed to do here. Because there is definitely a couple of points in the game that you're supposed to do this. It's not the most intuitive thing because it's not like you really have an idea that you'd actually get something out of it though, so... Yeah, it's it's uh, it's just kind of something that you blindly go and try, I guess. <laughs> There's a coin coffer. <laughs> that sort of helps, but it also knocks out my funds. Whoops. Well, maybe this isn't the one that I'm thinking of anyway. Well, that didn't give me anything other than a little chime. Oh, I was correct. You don't throw your hat at them. You just jump on them. And yeah, did you see that one that popped out that was extra special and glowy? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So now we are on to the solution. <laughs> Dang it. Let's go again. All right, I think I should just be a little bit smarter here. I think I'm just rushing too much. That's why I'm making so many dumb mistakes. So it's like I should just be nicking at like the the singular ones around the corner or something like that probably is the most likely wow is the most likely method but I even I'm in like missed miss jumping to boot <laughs> oh, really well it wasn't a glowy one there anyway we're back boys <laughs> maybe I should actually use my hat to at least stun them for the most part oh Jesus son of Arceus <laughs> This right here is the hardest moon in the game, guys! <laughs> At least... It, really? How, how am I making so many bad jumps like that? Like, seriously, this is this should not be anywhere, clo <laughs> anywhere close to as hard as I'm making it. Come on, guys, we all know how this is gonna end. I'm, I'm gonna get a moon from you guys, eventually, because I am ridiculously persistent. And it's gonna happen, whether you like it or not, so you might as well just cough up that moon. Dang it. Invincibility frames, invincibility frames. Might as well use that to my advantage. Alright, we need a glowy one here. Somewhere in there, maybe. Uh, no, I'm not seeing anything. Oh! I accidentally hit the glowing one! Get it! Go and get out of here! <sighs> Under the mummy's curse. <laughs> Good Arceus. Next location. Actually, I think the next location is that hint art. Now, as I said before, when it comes to the point that I actually do the hint art, I'm going to reshow the hint art. Uh-huh, it's a little hint over at Bowser's Kingdom, basically. Go to the Crazy Cap Shop and look at the stones on the ground between the shop as well as the checkpoint. And then do a little count. Six from the left, three from the right. And then just ground pound that particular stone. 
and you should be able to get a moon without any sort of trouble. 531, not too shabby. Woo! But there's still many, many more moons to get, <laughs> if you can believe it. And... It's just making a little pathway to the darker side. But that's until... Uh, that, that'll be later. First, Bowser's Kingdom. Skip, 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 skip. And... Loading screen, I'm sure. Because I skipped very quickly. Yeah. Uh, maybe we're better off with the cutscene over the regular black screen. <laughs> Alright. So let's warp over to the shop as soon as we can. Oh, yeah. There's a block here, of course. The moon rock here is glowing too, let's be sure to check that. It's by, by a gate, and whoops, wrong button. No, no don't, don't lock onto the shop. <laughs> lock onto the warp next to the shop, there you go. And see these rocks right here? One, two, three, and also one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, I'm ignoring Peach. Boink! And that's how it's done. Yeah, found with the Sen the Kingdom Art. I did it again, because I'm so used to mashing plus at this point. Alright, so... We were told about Peach going over... Well, I guess I could have got Peach there too, but... <laughs> I just want to kind of be progressive here. I was going to go whichever kingdom she says as we go. So, let's just plop a little moon there, which really counts for the Sand Kingdom. <laughs> And fly, my pretties, fly to the Wooded Kingdom. Skip, 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 skip. And I'm gonna probably press skip immediately when I get there to warp around <laughs> instead of the minus button. No, actually, the moon block is over at the upper, uh, yeah, I think it's like the upper right side of the Wooden Kingdom, I thought. I thought, and I just can just like roll over to it or something. But we'll see. We'll, we'll see what yeah. he has to say. Hmm? Moon Rock here is glowing too. Let's be sure to check that. Yeah, that's like upper right over there, I think. I thought. It's somewhere around this perimeter, dang it. <laughs> I think I've already passed it. Uh, and yeah, I know. There's still that hint art to get over there, by the way. I just want to go... There we go. <laughs> just trying to chain moves together all fancy-like, and that was a big no-go. Um. Hmm. Mm, moon block. Ow. Moon block. Moon block. I, I need to free you. I guess I didn't go too far. But yeah, as you could tell by the. I think this is actually a. Oh, I thought. I thought that was a moon for some reason. But no, no, not quite. Okay, I didn't go too far. Should have just continued along that path. But yeah, I was gonna say. You could tell that this was in the starting area because of those big walls. There's no other place that has a wall like that in the area, as it's all like that metal scaffolding. Or it's in the deep, dark woods. Anyway, moons scatter everywhere, and we're going to go collect a bunch of them. Well, maybe not too many of them before the end of this part, like maybe three to five or so, depending on how smoothly things go. Holy poopers! That has a lot of marks. There's one right behind us, right off the bat, though. Uh, I think it's actually a timer challenge up there. Yeah, this is the one that I said was quite difficult to get, that I thought that... Uh, why am I not... Why am I throwing my hack first before I do it the roll? I don't know. It's just... Some days, I swear to Arceus, like that. Like, why would I do that? That was actually a demonstrative. Oh, <laughs> uh, wait, what do you have to say? Just... Post game, you will find my fellow gardeners working everywhere, even far below us on the other side of that wall. Oh, I guess you do eventually tell the peeps that there is a deep, dark woods down there. And yes, I still have purple coins to get around here, but one thing at a time. <laughs> I'm just going to this one because it's kind of like the closest one, as well as it being quite an annoying one. So, we're, what we're looking for here is one of those little scarecrow dealios. Or, oh not, okay, that's not a scarecrow, it's, it's notes, but it's still like a timer challenge, dang it. Now, what we want to do here is flip the camera around and prepare to roll with precision. Ready? Uh-huh. 
Don't fall off the edge. Don't fall off the edge. You, oh, shoot. And we also gotta be fairly quick about this as well. You, there are no Jaxies here to use to your advantage. I didn't want to fall off over there. Got it. Wow. First try. Yo. <laughs> Taking notes on top of the wall. And I guess we can flop on over to it. Well, I was going to say look at dialogue, but I'm going to have to come back here to buy buy out the crazy cap shop later anyway. So, how about... We start here. The forest charging station. It's like mid-ground without actually having to climb up there naturally, I guess you could say. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at that! It's the Roving Racers, the same dialogue as we've seen in the past. And this is a pretty tricky one. Yeah, so you start over here, you gotta get all the way over there. Now, it seems like it's a straightforward path, isn't it? Well, what if I were to say that it's not? If you want to get some good times here. I just want to kind of go sneak on through here, if you don't mind. <laughs> oh, I actually did that kind of slow, but yeah, that is probably the fastest way to go. And I should probably do... Oh, shoot. That was terrible. I wanted to do... Yeah, that. Uh, there's also another... I mean, there's, there's shortcuts on top of the shortcuts with this one, by the way. Uh, but I'm going to go and do the most powerful shortcut here. We're going to go... Long jump, hat jump, over the top of the railing, and that is how you win this race, but not get a world record, because I kind of, kind of just a little bit inefficient there. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be a lot better when Goldie comes into the fray here. Thank you for the moon moon. You guys are collecting a lot of moons, aren't you? Two in each world? For each of these individual races? Yeah! I'm up for it. Let's go! S it's the Master Cup! And this is where you definitely want to take the route off to the left rather than the vine type area that a lot of the other ones go through. Because it's just so, so much more. Ooh! Didn't turn myself off to the side properly. And yup! Oh well. Oh, okay. Oh, that was good. That was actually quite good. One, two, kick and turn. Yes. Very nice. Grab the uproot very quickly with homing moves of happiness escape and prepare. Oh, you're in the way. You're terribly, terribly in the way. <laughs> Wasn't quite like that the other way, but I mean the other time, but eh. Eh, it still turned out okay. Whoa! Victory is mine. Alright. What do you have to say about that? The same dialogue, of course you do. <laughs> what a king, the Master Cup. And... Just, just out of curiosity. That's what I thought. Same dialogue. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, I guess I can hop down in... Well... I was going to say that pipe, but I think that's going to take me a while to do. Maybe I'll instead go over to... Oh, no, actually... Yeah, I think I want to go up on top of that. This, this side that I said was difficult to get up to before. Okay. <laughs> At least I think. Uh, what, was it on this side or was it on the other side? I don't know. You could, by the way, you could, if you don't want to do such a tricky jump, you could always just do a Goomba stack or something like that, but... You know, I'm just kind of speeding things along. That was terrible on my part. Uh, but yeah, I don't... I think it was actually... Uh, wait, was it all the way up? Ah, oh, it's up there! Glide on! Glide on! I, where was it? Glide on? No, no, no. The glide on. Observation deck. There we go. Okay, so I was right about it being on the scaffolding, just not at the level that I thought it was. And I hear you, Peach. I hear you. I guess I could talk to you, because I'm here. <laughs> the flowers in this kingdom are so lovely. I wonder how they grow them. I've never seen so many flowers! Oh! A little power popped out of a flower. I hope it helps you with your travels. Yeah, I gotta say, there are a lot of 
moons that pop out of seeds and flowers and stuff like that around this area, so that's pretty plausible. I wonder how the people in that underwater town spend their days. Maybe I'll ask them. Mm, same dialogue. So yeah, Lake Kingdom is up next after I clear out this stuff. But for now, where is that wall? <laughs> uh, wall, wall, wall. Wall, wall, wall. Shake your wall, wall. I see it down there. Shake your wall, wall. Just want to get a good angle here and pull back a little bit to slow down. So I can just kind of like boop, right out. And I was going to say break this open as I land on it, but eh, yeah, that'll work too. Looking down on the Goombas is a complete da. And we are most certainly looking down at the Goombas. Which means it's probably a good time to end off the part, because we got this beautiful sight here, I, I, I guess we could say. So with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I probably drop straight down that pipe.